Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited doing this video and another video for you guys. Well, I haven't owned any Zara perfume whatsoever. This is my first Zara perfume. I have been all over the places trying to find something really cool and suitable for my character, you know, and personality because for me, using a perfume, it has to be something personal, okay? Now, I haven't been using Zara so far and like I said, I am in the middle of, you know, a very minimalistic life. I'm not indulging myself, but when I buy something, it has to be something really worth the money. Now, I am so, so nervous to open this because I haven't opened it yet. You could see the box actually looks like this. It has a very, very beautiful, uh, some sort of like, you know, uh, shining in front, Zara, Femme and Nuit. These are eau de toilette et eau de parfum. Now, when you go at the back, you do have a sort of note. So you have Nuit up here mysteries arising from captivating eyes shapes of the unknown the notes of apricot lily of the valley and the vanilla now the fan on the other hand is warm yet smooth spirit ready to walk through fire notes of peony vanilla and musk i might be really liking this one because i was very confused should i get the fan should i get not now okay let's see we're gonna open to Hey, look at that it's very nice duo collections so we can an evening collection well you know i'm really lacking on that right now because to me i think perfume you can wear your perfume everywhere i mean it depends on what you really um want to put as an environment or so now we are opening the zara oh my god i'm so nervous i mean i am nervous you can tell Ooh, look, so it shows like this inside. And look at that, I like actually the little Zara really. I'm so excited, uh, yeah, I know. Ooh, so the Nui looks like this. I don't know if you can see properly though. Yeah, the Zara Nui looks like this, pinky, really dark. You know, it's a really beautiful bottle. I mean, I love the bottle though. Um, Actually, kind of a really, you know, exciting though to see, you know, um, by your eyes. I'm so excited. Okay, now let's open it. Oh my god. I'm not ready for it. I'm not ready for it. I'm not ready for it. Okay. So let me smell the notes. I just took the chance to keep all both of the Zara perfume on top so that we can start the review. Now, I'm not um, really having the vanilla to the Nuit. I kind of smell a little bit, but this is not a strong vanilla scent. If you are on that side of gourmand, vanilla, sweet, warm and cozy, you know, caramelly or something like that, this is not it. I think this has a very fruity note, but mixed with the floral. So this is like a fruity, floral, fresh type of scent. To me, it's beautiful, but it doesn't have um, that, because they said it's a dupe of La Vie Belle, and I've honed a very few La Vie Belle uh, in my collections. This is not smelling like literally La Vie Belle. This is more fresh than La Vie Belle because La Vie Belle is a very sweet and very gourmand, you know, type of scent. It's very opening up to very sexy and seductive feminine. This one right here, it's more of, it's more of fresh, okay? I don't know if that makes sense, okay? This is just like a very honest review. It's more of fresh, fruity, and floral at the same time. I'm not able to smell so much the vanilla, and I guess the projection to this, it's not gonna last long. I already feel it. Yeah, it's not going to last long. But it's pretty, I mean, it's pretty if you really on a budget and you're looking for something to wear every day and I guess this is it, really. Um, I'm not gonna wear this for night, but I think if I'm wearing this for evening, I might be, you know, adding some vanilla layering perfume to it, just like to enhance that little tones of vanilla into it. 
Now, let's move forward from this one right here, Fam of Zara. Look at the bottle. Oh my God, I love it. Look, look at the bottle. It's so minimalistic though. That's what I love about their bottle. I'm really, really fond of it. Um, Zara Fam, I have heard so much things about this. I am so, so excited to know about the scents. Let's open it. I haven't smelled this though, you guys. So now I'm kind of like smelling it in front of you. Okay, let's smell it. Ooh. <laughs> oh my God, this is pretty. Now, these actually, the notes are, have a peony, vanilla, and musk. Oh my God, this is so pretty. And this says, I judge, they say this is the dupe of uh, Hypnotic or Miracle of Lancome. And this is so pretty. I've owned a Miracle in the, in the past. Yeah, it's approaching Miracle because Miracle is very fresh, feminine, you know, it's it's literally a freshness in the bottle, but had that sweetness a little bit because of the vanilla. And the musk in here, I bet, it's giving, you know, that little masculine note. It doesn't, it doesn't have that so much masculine to it, but I feel like it has that little... Yeah, it has that musk to it, so it gives and brings back a little bit of masculine to it, but very, very beautiful perfume. Yeah, I love Femme. I think Femme, uh, in between Femme and Nui, I don't hesitate, it has to be Femme. I was very skeptical, actually, about the Femme. I was very excited about the Nui, but you know, right now, um, my heart goes straight to fam. This is so pretty. I think this is the type of perfume I will wear every single day, you know, to do, I mean, I don't know, to go to work, you know, uh, to go and get my kids out of from school. Um, this is definitely like a daily perfume, but very, very nice though. You can wear it at evening, you can layering it. Um, if you do have a peony from Bath & Body Works, you definitely want it to layer a little bit with it, even a vanilla note, right? I feel like this is so pretty. I mean, this can be, can be very nice. Okay, let's enjoy Fam of Zara. Let's enjoy Me from Zara. Thank you very much for watching. Don't you forget to subscribe if you are really interested to see what type of perfume we're gonna review next time. And of course, tick the little bell so that you won't miss any video when I'm uploading. And comment down below, which is your Zara perfume? What is your favorite Zara perfume right now? As like to me, this is a new, uh, a new adventure. I never own any Zara perfume, and I'm really hoping that I will get my hands on so many of Zara perfume. But I am very excited about this purchase, though, especially the Fam of Zara. Nui is definitely a beautiful perfume, but you need to understand that it has a very floral, fruity uh, type of scent, and it makes it can be a very overwhelming and overpowering if you don't like a very, you know, a kind of like floral fruity mix. Zara perfume, fam, it's kind of a really, you know, seductive, very subtle, very fresh, very, you know, a little bit sweet, but it has a little musk to it, which brings back that little masculine to it, but in a very, very good way. So yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I see you in my next one.